NASA has confirmed for the first time the unambiguous detection of water molecules on the sunlit surface of the moon. This discovery indicates that water may be distributed across the lunar surface and not limited to cold, shadowed places. The water molecules are present in one of the largest craters visible from Earth, called the Clavius Crater, located in the moon's southern hemisphere. Data from this location reveals water in concentrations of 100 to 412 parts per million, roughly equivalent to a 12-ounce bottle of water trapped in a cubic meter of soil spread across the lunar surface. As a comparison, the Sahara Desert has 100 times the amount of water than what NASA detected in the lunar soil. Despite the small amounts, it raises new intriguing questions about deep space exploration and challenges the current understanding of the lunar surface. The origin of water on the moon is one of the big picture questions. Understanding the origins of water on the moon can also shed light on the origins of Earth's water, still an open question in planetary science. Currently, the major contenders are comets, asteroids, or small interplanetary dust particles, the solar wind, and the moon itself through outgassing from volcanic eruptions. To read the complete story, click the link in the description box below.